Hi. So um, today I wanted to talk to you about an energy that's been coming through. It's been a little bit confusing, but a lot of individuals from um, Walk With Me Now have also mentioned it. So I wanted to talk to you about it and see how you feel about this. I will also be giving a lot more details during our monthly call at Walk With Me Now, which will be then stored in our library if you want to see it. <clears throat> Anyways, since Monday, um, and this is the end of September now, so Friday is the 27th, I think. I don't know what day it is today. I lost track. But I think on Monday, uh, probably, what is it, 24th, something like that. Um, September 2019, uh, there was starting Sunday then Monday Tuesday probably Wednesday today there's been this energy and feeling of like sadness and loss um, it's everybody that I know um, gave it explanations of things that were happening in their life but it's it's beyond it you know and when I was looking at it, in, I went into a meditative state last night to look at it specifically to observe it, not to observe it, but um, to contemplate on it. And it felt like it's a frequency that our physical bodies can't quite interpret. It's very similar. It could be sadness, it could be happiness, it could be fear, it could be excitement. So when I realized that that was going on, I knew that it was external. Then this morning, some of the uh, Walk With Me Now members sent links to an article that talked about um, frequencies, earth frequencies, hertz and stuff. I, I'm not really very familiar with the frequencies and things, um, but uh, something to, to do with a resonance type thing on the earth, Gaia's heartbeat, they call it and how it was the highest it had ever been and how individuals will either feel it um, as something nice or something negative depending on where they are at life I guess or what's going on in their life um, and it really made sense to me because the conclusion I came to last night and again I looked at it this morning was that it felt external but that the physical body was trying to tuned to it um, when I touched into it to see if it was artificial it didn't feel artificial um, so and also but it felt almost like you will feel it properly and you'll be able to interpret it if it it you can get it to resonate completely with your physical body um, and also you can choose whether it's uh, positive or negative and um, oh, she wants to say hi to. Yeah. There's somebody, there's somebody in there. We're in a campground right now. <laughs> and there's somebody coming out of their trailer. So, yeah, she's controlling herself very well. Good girl. Um, it's a choice <laughs> point again. So. Don't despair if you're feeling all sorts of strange stuff and, you know, or either complete sadness or complete happiness, stuff like that. Um, it's going to be okay, I think. Yeah. It reminds me, and Larry mentioned it this morning, it did remind me of the three days of darkness that we were talking about, which is only experienced as darkness if you're in a low frequency or choose to go into fear. Or it's experienced as, a, you know, pure light and happiness if you choose to drop those fears and negative things and go into a natural state. Maybe it's that. Three days, that could be 20. Anyways, um, I thought I'd let you know. Um, and that's it for today. Thanks. Bye.